Looking for even more reasons to see Deadpool and Wolverine? People who saw the first act of the Mutant Team-Up movie say that it goes to some pretty crazy places. It's been six years since Deadpool 2 dropped in theaters, making the end of the long wait for Deadpool and Wolverine even more exciting. The MCU's first R-rated superhero flick hits theaters at the end of July, but for those who really couldn't wait, an exclusive 35-minute sneak peek was screened as a part of its promotional tour at an event in London's Hammersmith Eventum Apollo. Movie critics lucky enough to bear witness to the footage at the London Hammersmith Eventum Apollo screening shared their reactions on social media, describing it as one of the most outrageously fun and entertaining installments in the Marvel Cinematic Universe so far. Director Sean Levy introduced the footage to the audience along with leads Hugh Jackman and Ryan Reynolds, paving the path for glowing responses to the film. Of course, the footage was only meant to be a quick peek into the unpredictable multiverse that's now become Deadpool's playground. The tone and intent of the rest of the story past the first 35 minutes remains to be seen, but the consensus echoed among the audience members is that you might not be ready for what's to come. It seems like the team behind Deadpool and Wolverine took some seriously big swings, and if those early reactions are to be believed, they resulted in some major home runs. I am Marvel Jesus. So what are critics saying about the long-awaited Super Reunion? Looper's Nick Staniforth tweeted that the energy at the screening was electric, saying, The excitement levels for Deadpool and Wolverine have just gone through the roof. The first 30 minutes prove that Wade and the Wolverine are cutting loose in the best way possible. Gimme the whole film. Emily Murray, an editor at Games Radar Plus, agreed wholeheartedly. As she puts it, It's an absolute blast. They understood the assignment and are more than delivering, was laughing right from the opening gag. It's dumb. It's fun. Can't wait to see the rest. Let's f***ing go. Let's Go. Critic Scott J. Davis underlined the film's ability to subvert expectations in a reaction tweet of his own, writing, Saw the footage from Deadpool and Wolverine, and y'all ain't ready for it. Forget what you think you know. Been anything you think might happen, because Ryan Reynolds and company have sneakily but brilliantly constructed their marketing and their film. Can't wait to see it in all its glory. But wait, there's more. Director Billy Melissa shared a tweet about the footage premiere, stating that MCU superfans will relish all the Easter eggs strewn across the narrative. More critical reactions include that of Ian Sanwell, editor at Digital Spy, who assured readers that even though Wade Wilson has moved to the MCU, he hasn't lost his signature irreverence. He elaborated, I have seen 35 minutes of Deadpool and Wolverine. It's a promising start with an excellent opening gag, and if you're still worried Deadpool has been tamed, the bloody and outrageous first set piece will resolve any worries. Multiple critics praised the opening gag in particular, so fans can look forward to a gory good time from the very beginning. If you thought that was it, you're dead wrong. Critic Katie Smith Wong tweeted that, despite the short duration of the footage she'd seen, it was enough to reach the conclusion that the movie in its entirety would be an epic, hilarious blast. Writer and critic Christopher Mills was also enthusiastic about what he saw, posting, Each joke is perfectly timed and well-written. They managed to still hide a lot away from us, and even with showing us a sneak peek of unseen spoilery footage, I got no clue what direction we're heading in, but I'm fully on board. Want to talk about what's haunting you, or should we wait for a third act flashback? Uh, go f yourself. Games Radar Plus writer Amy West also enjoyed the sneak peek. She called out succession actor Matthew McFadden, who plays a TVA agent named Paradox, as the movie's MVP. The rest of these early critical reactions touch upon similar high points, with nearly everyone agreeing that they can't wait to see the remaining hour and a half. They'll definitely be in line at the theater when Deadpool and Wolverine is released to the masses on July 26, 2024.